Hey everyone, it's the late 1992 again, here with more Fire Emblem. Uh, since my other party wasn't working, I decided to uh, go ahead and break a couple rules because I'm using uh, Seth and Ford right now. So, uh, yeah, we'll see how this goes, shall we? My main goal is really to get to Dusel and recruit Dusel in the least amount of time possible. So I have more time to react to, uh, and whatnot once he comes into the battle. Because uh, recruiting Cormag is a very nice thing to do. And you know, frankly, I've failed at this enough and it's time for me to do better. <laughs> Yes, yes, we've seen that scene already. And the enemies come break themselves upon Seth. Fun, fun. Of course, I don't think Kyle's actually skilled enough with a sword to actually get a double hit, so... Might as well help him out with harder a little bit there. There we go, that should put Kyle up to level 10 now. Really? This this game just hates me now. <laughs> That's what it is. I was playing Fire Emblem 7 uh, the other day. Yesterday, actually. And, uh... When my characters leveled up, they mo they'd mostly get, uh... Anywhere from 3 to 5 stats in a level. <laughs> and, uh... Especially uh, Rebecca, one of the archers in that game. And I'm like, really? You can't... You can beat out Naomi that simply? And, but why does this game decide, oh hey, we'll just uh, give you Naomi and screw you over on every single level up? It, it, it <laughs> there are no words for the anger I feel at that. Oh hey, he hit Ford in the face, that's not nice. Haha, <laughs> you missed Arter, now Arter kills you. Alright then. Let's see what I can do with this. Why does that Cavalier have a Horse Slayer? That is bogus beyond belief. But anyway, I hate horse slayers. They're not nice weapons, especially around uh, paladins and cavaliers. Basically, anything that uses a horse. But hey, Arnold leveled up. You people are trying to get me killed. I see how it is. It's official. I'm not allowed to play games with random numbers anymore. Yeah, except for when I like to play Fire Emblem 7, because I prefer that game to this one. <laughs> but hey, I love this game, there's no getting around that one, so... I'm going to play it for all it's worth, viewers, I promise. Although what it's worth might not be that much anymore. <laughs> Yeah, this is one of the reasons that uh, I banned the use of Seth, because he just plows through everything like he did in Chapter 6. 
I think that was chapter 6. Um... Yeah, it was definitely chapter 6 right after I got Joshua. And now you guys get to see something very special. I'm actually going to recruit Doosla. Hmm. Yeah, you might as well toss the ocean seal into the uh, supply. Ephraim, talk to Dussel. That man has a very flat face. Oh no no, I'm a traitor knight, I've been disgraced, yada yada yada. Dude, you're old. Old people can't think like that. You gotta think fresh. Exactly. See, Ephraim, he must take after his mother, because Erica and King Fado are nowhere near this intelligence. At least he understands. That's that's the big point here. And we get Dussel, great night, yay! <laughs> See if I can pick up anything for him here. Ooh! Tell you what, I'll be right back. All right, uh, just outfitted Dussel a little better. Got some stuff for my uh, supplies. And I'm having Ford visit this uh, village. Hey, that's Marissa. We know who Marissa is. Da 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 da. What did you find? Oh, oh! I know what it is. I know what it is. I know what it is. It's a hero crest. Excellent. This is how victory is won. Very slowly and very. No, I've just got slowly for that sentence. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's see if I can have uh, Cole do something legitimate with the. Uh, he can't use the Lance Reaver yet. That's beautiful. Kyle can't use the last reaper yet. That's wonderful. And I'm not letting Seth... Oh, well, yeah, I shouldn't let Seth or Kyle do it anyway because they've got, uh... You know, horses. <laughs> oh, yeah, you gotta watch out for people with swords that are using their huh? Oh, and now they finally start attacking, uh... Dussel's Cavaliers. Which... Is really just stupid in my opinion. Let's see, which one's Cormag? As long as no one gets in Cormag's way, I should be pretty much safe. Also, I love Dussel's battle animation, it's just so hardcore. But yeah, I want Cormag to get as close to Dussel as possible without actually, uh, you know, doing any damage to anybody. Because, uh,. It's safer that way. See, um... The farthest Cormac can reach is right here, next to this mercenary. So really, I should be pretty much safe. But, uh, who wants to ch take chances, yeah? <laughs> Ooh, level up for Gilliam, hooray!
Eh. It's not like Gilliam has good stat growth so they're in defense anyway. Okay. Well, uh, this is the White Man 1992, and this is all for episode 50 of Let's Play Fire Emblem. Uh, I hope you guys are enjoying it so far, because I know I sure am.